well, quarter past six, uh, Tuesday the 20th of April. It's a lovely evening looking, looking towards the west here. Uh, very misty in the distance. Hopefully we're gonna get a really nice sunset. Um, I'm gonna walk up and over by St. Catherine's Oratory and then down to the Hoy Monument uh, where I believe there is basically a field of bluebells. So I'm hoping to photograph that um, in the golden hour light. Uh, golden hour is probably three quarters of an hour away. So I'm just gonna, just gonna have my cup of coffee and then head up and over the hill. So uh, I'll meet you by the St. Catherine's Oratory. Okay, so after that short, steep climb, I'm a little bit out of breath, and I approach St. Catherine's Oratory. Uh, I did a video a month ago or so about how this place got its name. <laughs> so if you're interested, uh, check that one out. I found it quite interesting. But tonight, I'm not gonna dwell here. I'm moving on uh, to the Hoy Monument. Okay, so downhill for a bit now. I don't know if you've seen the distance there. There's the Hoy Monument. So uh, here we are, like halfway really from the oratory to, uh, to the uh, Hoy Monument. Just taking a peek over this hill. And uh, it's misty. But it is nice. The temperature, temperature beginning to tumble. Uh, I might take a picture of those cows in the field over there. They're being lit up nicely. Obviously, I don't want to mix with them. That's the only way I'm going to get between them. If it's my shadow. Oh, look, they're trampling all over me. So, St. Catherine's Hill, where the where St. Catherine's Oratory is, turns into St. Catherine's Down, where we've got the Hoy Monument. What a glorious evening. Okay, so I'm uh, now walking, I've got my camera right now, and I'm walking towards the Hoy Monument. Uh, I'm going to do a bit of uh, a hyperlapse to get there so you can see the route. Now, there's a pole here. All right, it's quite close to the monument, but not that close. And it says, risk of falling objects. We're at the top of a hill. So whether there's space debris that rains down or, uh, <laughs> you know, uh, lead shot from people hunting grouse or something, I have no idea. But anyway, it looks like rocks. I can only presume that is from the actual monument itself. Uh, there's a risk of things falling down. I don't know. Uh, 
if, if anyone knows, put them in the comments. Now, here's a, it's like a mini trig point. I don't know, I don't know what it is here. What was this? Just, uh, yes, it looks like there was something a bit more substantial here at one point. And only a stump of it left. All right, right, yeah. This has got risk of falling objects as well. So I guess it must be. Uh, that, maybe the monument is crumbling away. And if you get too close, the risk of that ball on the top tumbling down and falling on your head. A bit like the, uh, the New Year's ball in Times Square. Lovely sight, what a glorious, glorious evening. Really still. So this, this looks like a, a remodeled uh, plaque. It says, in commemoration, com I'll start again. In commemoration of the visit of, the of his Imperial Majesty, Alexander I, Emperor of all of the Russias, to Great Britain in the year 1814, in remembrance of the many happy years of residence in his, in his dominions, this pillar was erected by Michael Hoy. This was stone was recut in 1992 by white stone masonry. Because there's a plaque on the other side that I'm struggling to read some of it because it's a bit faded. So I'll have a look. If I just go up there, you see there's a half moon by the top. I'm going to try and photograph that. I've tried to take a few with the sun in the background, the orange sun. So, um, and then I'll, I'll, I'll try and get to <laughs> um, the, the pepper pot, St. Catherine's Oratory, maybe maybe before the sun completely disappears. Right, so let's take one of the moon. Right, I'm gonna to touch, risk the fall-in object. Right, I'm on my way now, back to, uh, back towards the pepper pot. Can I get there to get a few last minute photographs of the sun which has disappeared before the cloud. I'm just gonna, I can't resist that one. Look at that. The sun sort of halfway behind the time, cloud, the orange ready stream of light on the water there. Just approaching the pepper pot. It's a really lovely evening, but I think the sun's gone for good. Uh, the temperature's dropped. I've enjoyed the walk. I enjoyed exploring around the Hoy Monument, and I'm a bit disappointed I didn't uh, find any bluebells like I was hoping. I'll have to come back. I don't know if they weren't out where I was hoping or whether they're just in the wrong place. 
Oh, I'll just show you the scene here. You've got like a layer of mist by the uh, cliffs over there, the west of white. You can see the south coast, uh, you know, the Bournemouth area, Dorset, old, old Harry Rocks, Dublin, off there to the west. And then you can see the one, two, five red lights on the radio mass there as a, a, list, uh, a mist begins to form in the valley. That's where I've just been, the Hoy Monument over there. So, it seems like a, a good spot here as I approach the pepper pot. I'll take one or two shots just for the heck of it. And I'll say thank you for joining me. And I will see you on the next one.